Just imagine having ice cream that never melts, chocolate eggs that has a chocolate birds, and big chocolate fountains. This is what Willy Wonka used to make in his chocolate factory. Well, this was happening in the movie Willy Wonka, Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. Good evening, Toastmasters, OLPNs and parents. Good evening. Good evening. What comes to our mind when we think of chocolates? Something that really tastes uh, sweet and tasty? Yes. That's what I used to think before I got to know more about chocolates. <coughs> Chocolate comes from a bean called cocoa. The first people to have actually discovered the secret of the cocoa were the Mayans. They took the cocoa tree from the rainforest and planted it in the own in their own backyard where they fermented, roasted and harvested and ground the seeds into a paste. They mixed this paste with waters, peppers and cornmeal and made it into a spicy chocolate drink. This drink was called the drink of the gods. Because cocoa and sugar were ex very expensive to import, only those with money could afford to buy chocolate. In fact, in France, chocolate was, a, was only consumed by the people of the royal court. For centuries, chocolate remained a handmade luxury sip only by rich people. But by the 1800s, mass production made chocolate affordable to many people. Chocolate was used not only as a drink, but it was also used for many medicinal purposes such as relieving fatigue, treating burns, cuts and skin <coughs> infections. Nowadays, each American eats about 9 pounds of chocolate per year. Despite this heartfelt story, chocolate is one of the many things that are often avoided. Whether it's because it causes cavities or makes you fat. But one of the things that people don't know is chocolate is actually good for you. Some facts. One plain milk chocolate has, has more protein than a banana. American and Russian flights have always carried chocolate as a part of a diet. The first chocolate box was introduced by Cadbury. Scientists have re re recently discovered that uh, uh, eating a modified form of chocolate actually slows down the process of aging. Most of you have, uh, you would have seen the Hershey's chocolate bars. There is an entire town called Hershey's in the US. You can visit the chocolate factory there. Today when people visit the US, or other countries, chocolate made the most common form of gift over all else. In 20 years, chocolate could be very, could become very really expensive that we may not even be able to afford it. The reason is that cocoa trees are not growing as fast as people are buying chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> so folks, enjoy yourself and treat yourself to chocolate while you can. There is a saying, 9 out of 10 people love chocolates and the 10% really actually likes.